At NYU, I teach uh, uh, mainly script writing and directing. It's about trying to make a film and learn from the making, and the process itself is what matters eventually. I got involved in filmmaking uh, when I watched uh, the first film I ever watched. Uh, I fell in love with cinema. The first film I, I really started thinking about doing it and uh, loving real cinema was Back to the Future, actually. My father took me to the cinemas to watch it. And it was, you know, I, 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 didn't, I had so many questions and I just fell in love with cinema and tried, and I started actually investigating uh, what is it? How is this magic uh, done? Then uh, uh, I, I was too scared to pursue this career, so I went to engineering school. And I started engineering uh, just because I was good in physics and math. But then after I, I was done with my degree, I started making short films. And this led me to do my first feature film. I started uh, my journey with AFS Young Filmmakers uh, two years ago, and I thought it was uh, a brilliant idea to work with high school kids and through the work with them, let them realize that film and filmmaking is a form of expression and they can use it to actually talk about things that matter to them. So I work in a very, very uh, special way with those, those kids. Uh, I start with working with what I call the annoyance something that bothers them from their everyday life. So it's not something big, it's not something philosophical, it's something that bothers them. And then through it, we develop uh, a philosophy that they would like to deliver to the audience. And through it, we develop the how to do it. We try to understand what is the best way and what is the best form of storytelling to deliver this uh, uh, philosophy and have an impact on the audience. So it's a very long process in which they completely uh, uh, discover themselves and discover what is unique in them and they understand that it's not something that is far-fetched, it's just, it's there, they just need to find a way to express it. At NYU I teach uh, uh, mainly script writing and directing. I also teach uh, my, uh, the method that I developed with my friend uh, in Ajami to work with non-actors, so it's a course in which we invite the local community and we have usually um, around 50 people that join uh, 15 students through a 10-week workshop and eventually my students they make films with those uh, non-actors so so we're not detached or disconnected from the community here and we're very much involved uh, with local talent of um, aspiring filmmakers aspiring actors and we're constantly working with uh, with those talents. The best advice that I got and I try to deliver it to my students and to the people that I work with is the understanding that filmmaking is a process, a learning process just like life and if you are too afraid to make it and too judgmental you will never be able to make it. So it's all about trial and error, it's about trying to make a film and learn from the making and the process itself is what matters eventually. I see a very bright future for filmmaking in the, UAE, in the UAE. Recently we've seen a lot of new talent uh, working in uh, various genres and uh, especially you know when, when, I, when I see the kids in AFS, uh, Young Filmmakers uh, program and I'm just like I'm, I'm full of hope Beyond the talent that those kids have, there's a, a passion of really talking critically about their words and of provoking thoughts to others. Uh, there are a lot of uh, uh, issues, uh, social, cultural, that people are willing and want to talk about them. And I think this is magnificent because eventually, what is art if it's not uh, 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 something that provokes thought and uh, changes the world little by little, let's say. I think the Young Filmmakers program is crucial, not, not only important, it's very, very important uh, to the residents, the young residents and, and the Emirati uh, youngsters in the UAE for two reasons. 
First, first of all, because there's this idea that filmmaking is not accessible. It's something for know, the West, for Hollywood, for Europe. And maybe there's an idea that maybe our stories, our local stories are not interesting. But in fact, through this program, those kids discover that every story matters. And actually, you know what? The audiences are more interested in the local personal stories than in the same global stories that we're watching again and again and again. So I think this is crucial and also discovering, you know, uh, their unique voice and understanding that every single person is special and every single person has something to say and it ha he or she has the right to say it.